How guys today we'll talk about this Smash Bros. list of characters that's being Smash Bros. Okay. The list gets bad when we get to number I think it's nine. But yep, this is the top ten list of top ten characters that's being Smash Bros. Of course in the top tens you can make you can make your own lists and have people vote on them. And yep, and there's community lists and there's prior and there's you know Public list was so basically you can only make one of and everybody can vote on. It can make your own list that only you and certain people can rearrange the order of the numbers. But yep, and it can also remix of the popular list as well. And yep, this is the top 10 characters that's being Smash Bros. according to the top 10s. Yep, like most of the top 10s lists, they're probably not that great. So, no, yeah, probably the top 5 characters could probably be characters that are requested Crystal from Star Fox. Again, there's a lot of spam accounts on the on the top ten. So this one, if you look at the remixes, there's a lot of spam accounts getting Cooper and Rogue the Bat and Crystal up very high on this list. Crystal is always a very requested character to begin with, but there was a lot of spam accounts. They don't really give any. Yeah, there, yeah, top tens doesn't really know how to deal with those pe types of people. It's by the same guy making the same accounts to pull up their characters. Sado from Sonic, Wow, Easy, Ridley. And yeah, I made a I made a remix of this list, and it, and all the characters I wanted went up a lot. So yeah, probably sat on Wild Weezy went up. Ridley, yep, Ridley's all in the game. Bowser Jr. is all in the game. Bowser, Tails, we're not gonna go over the actual characters that have a chance at Smash Bros. We're gonna go over the stupid list. Mewtwo all in the game, and then we have Goku. Yep, this is a, this is the top ten. Okay, you know Smash community gets angry when got angry when I kept saying Goku should be in Smash, but then we have the top tens. Oh yeah, the top tens, they don't they don't give a crap. Okay, of course people are saying that, you know, you know, that Goku should be in the game, you know. And yeah, this yeah, people just, just stop asking for Goku, okay? He has its own fighting games, okay? If you really want to play as a Goku in a fighting game, let's play Dragon Ball Fighters, okay? He won't be in Smash Bros. Even Sakurai said that it was Goku and Iron Man specifically. Stop asking for these two characters. We're sick of it. Another character they catch that they that won't be in Smash. I think it's from, you know, it's a care it's a you know as a character from Tekken, the Tekken creator said, no, no Tekken characters are being Smash Bros. Stop asking for them. Yep, Goku. <laughs> next is Paper Mario. Probably, yeah, I think Paper Mario will be the next Mario character in Smash. Pootsie, Steve. We're going we're gonna to skip over the characters that actually, have a, that actually have a chance. Or, you know, actually our characters that have a chance at Smash Bros. Or characters that are in the game. So, yep. And then we have Spongebob. Yep, Spongebob is on the list. Why? Why would he want Spongebob and Smash Bros? Okay, he's 15 on the list. Higher than characters that are very well requested. And yeah, oh yeah, we have Spongebob on this list, okay? Spongebob will never be in Smash, okay? He is a cartoon character. And yeah, it's basically specified that, yeah, it's Goku and Shrek. Why do people, yeah, those people actually want Spongebob and Smash. There's like 20 comments here. Probably half the comments are saying he will never be in Smash. And probably half of them are saying, yeah, he'll be so amazing because he's Spongebob. And he's part of my childhood, blah, blah, blah. Nobody cares. Spongebob will not be in Smash Bros, okay? I'm sorry that I hurt you, you know. You know it's a Spongebob won't be in Smash Bros. He, he's not going to be appearing. He is not a video game character. He is owned by Nickelodeon of, you know, there's no fourth party companies, okay? There's no fourth party companies. Okay, that's a whole term made up. There's first party, second party, and third party companies, okay? Basically, Spongebob is a third party character, okay? He is owned by Nickelodeon. Unless Nickelodeon is owned by a fourth party, then yeah, Spongebob won't be in Smash. He's not, he's not even a game. He's a cartoon character. He probably won't, he probably, he probably, he probably, probably fit better in Smash than some of the other characters in the list, but nope, he won't be in Smash Bros. Never happening in any future timeline. Nope. Spongebob won't be in Smash. Bomberman, yeah, we're skipping. Darth Vader, yep. Darth Vader, so yep, Darth Vader. De no, there was gonna be, and yeah, we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna get over the Disney thing. Disney, uh, yeah, Nintendo's not gonna put anything owned by Disney in Smash Bros, okay? You know, not, uh, yeah, D Darth Vader is owned by Disney, and I don't think, you know, Nintendo's gonna put any Disney-related characters in Super Smash Bros, okay? You can want to see characters all you want, but he won't be in Smash Bros. Koopa, Master Chief, Crash Bandicoot, Homer Simpson. Oh, yeah, the next character on the list is Homer Simpson. Okay, he won't be in Smash Bros. He's a cartoon character, okay? I don't have to really have to, I don't have to explain this, but of course, the top tens, okay? People in the top tens want Homer Simpson over Subway Night, okay? You know, and there's no comment saying Homer Simpson will never be in Smash Bros, okay? 
you know, he won't be in Smash Bros, okay? He is, you know, like with SpongeBob, like with Darth Vader, I don't think Nintendo's going to open the floodgates for non-gaming characters because people are going to want Homer Simpson, people are going to want, you know, Darth Vader, Thanos, ridiculous characters like that that are not going to, that won't fit in Smash Bros just because they had a few licensed games on the Nintendo consoles, okay? Subtle Knight, Patrick Style. Again, we always explain this with Spongebob. Spongebob characters won't be in Smash Bros. It's a cartoon character. He won't be in Smash. He is not appearing in the game. And yep, Little Mac. Yeah, Zeno, Sceptile. Oh yeah, Zeno. Even though he's a gaming character. Come on, he won't be in Smash Bros, okay? You guys are like, oh, Zeno will be in Smash Bros. Because he's so amazing. Because I went, because I... Cause, because I grew up on Mario 64, not Mario 64, Mario RPG. No, he won't be in Smash Bros. Xeno will not be appearing in the game, okay? I am sorry. That is the truth. Xeno will not be in the game, okay? You know, I know people want to see this character in Smash Bros. Again, Square Enix is not going to put Xeno in Smash Bros. for you, okay? It's not happening. Xeno is not even owned by Nintendo. And they want, and you're asking Square Enix to put a character over Final Fan uh, from from one Mario game that nobody that nobody over the age uh under the age of thirty has played in Smash Bros. Okay, no no the younger audience say who's Geno? The only people who want Geno are mostly nineties and eighties kids, okay? Who grew up on Mario RPG Resident Seven Styles, okay? Those are the only people who really want Geno in Smash Bros. Okay? Yeah. And yeah, Zeno hasn't really appeared in a major Mario game since Mario RPG in the Resident Evil 7 style. So yeah, Zeno in Mario terms is not really relevant. You have characters like Toad, Koopa, and Waluigi who have been in way more games, who are way more important to the and Paper Mario, who are higher than Zeno, who are way more important to the Mario franchise, and would make much better characters than Zeno. Okay, and yeah, you can yeah, Zeno is also owned by Square Enix. And we all, and we don't know, Square Enix is one, was the most difficult company to deal with to put in Smash Bros. Because Square Enix, Crowd, Crowd was the last character to be approved of all of the base roster characters. I won't be surprised if Hero was the last of the DLC characters. You know, I bet Terry was pretty easy to put in Smash Bros. Joker because Atlas is owned by Sega. And, yeah, it's got, Hero is still probably the hardest to put in Smash. So, yeah, Zeno's not being in Smash Bros., okay? You know, and, yeah, then, and yeah we're going over here. And, yep, <laughs> Vidanity, Mega Man, me, Kumoto, Powerful. Razz and Quake, nope, not happening. He has a Sony property. Sony and Nintendo are competitors. But well, why did you skip over Master Chief then, okay? But... Bazo Kazoo is in Smash Bros. And uh, we and you gotta realize this, okay? The CEO of Microsoft is open to playing Microsoft characters in Smash Bros. Okay, obviously, okay. You know, you have you see that Bazo Kazoo is in Smash Bros. and he is a Microsoft owned character, okay? And yeah, he's in Smash Bros. Steve could probably be in Smash Bros. I think Steve is more likely than Master Chief, considering how big Minecraft is. Mine yeah, Microsoft and Nintendo have a much better relationship than Nintendo and Sony. Nintendo and Sony have hated each other ever since the whole Nintendo PlayStation fiasco, okay? Razor and Crank will never be in Smash Bros. And yeah, that's it about Razor and Crank. Yep. A Nintendo dog, that's just a comedy. That's not going to be in Smash Bros. Why would he beat up a dog, okay? I know Isabel's in Smash Bros, but why would he want to beat up a dog, okay? It's a sad, you know, why would you be up a dog? Why would you be up a dog, okay? You know, yeah, we're skipping over. Swack. Yep, Swack won't be in Smash Bros, okay? I know this is a meme character, but yeah, Swack won't be in Smash Bros. He's never going to be in Smash Bros. And yeah, he's never going to be in Smash Bros. Because Swack is a movie character. He's owned by his DreamWorks. He's not owned by Nintendo, okay? And yeah, not going to be in Smash Bros. Yep. Not there's gonna be no more Final Fantasy characters. Same thing with Black Veins. Kyoto will not be in Smash Bros. Like of Goku, he is an anime manga character. He does not. He is not gonna be in Smash Bros. Okay, you know, and yeah, and also he in El Combat. Yep, another character that won't be in Smash Bros. He is a cartoon character. Okay, he is a he is a TV character. Okay, same thing with Homer Simpson. He won't be in Smash Bros. Okay, and yeah, this was a oh yeah, next is Batman. Okay. Sakurai doesn't want Iron Man Smash Bros. Why do you think that Batman has any better of a chance? Oh, but he had his own games. But again, Batman is a comic book character, not a video game character. Aang won't be in Smash Bros. either. 
okay? Same walk he used with Spongebob. He's a cartoon character. He's not a game character, okay? But yet, he is higher than characters that could actually be in Smash Bros. Jimmy Neutron, he is a movie character, okay? He's not going to be appearing in Smash Bros, okay? And I don't even like Jimmy Neutron to begin with, so he won't be in Smash Bros, okay? You know, this guy won't be in Smash Bros. He's a cartoon character. Goofy won't be in Smash Bros. Again, Disney... Well, why would Nintendo probably wouldn't want to deal with Disney. Even Disney, Nintendo doesn't even make their own theme park, and guess what they went to? They went to Universal, not, you know, Disney. They, Nintendo doesn't even want to deal with Disney, so Goofy won't be in Smash Bros. Same thing with Saw. Saw is owned by Disney, so he won't be in Smash Bros. You know, Fat Albert won't be in Smash Bros. Okay. You know, Wreck-It Ralph, he's a movie character. He's owned by Disney, won't be in Smash Bros. Vegeta, same thing with Goku. And now in Orange, why do you want this thing in Smash Bros? You know, why is this even in the top 100? Won't be in Smash Bros. Mickey Mouse won't be in Smash Bros. Bros. Neon Cat, a meme, won't be in Smash Bros. Saw, won't be in Smash Bros. Popeye. Okay, we gotta, we gotta go, go with Popeye. If you don't know, Popeye was the character that... Okay, I know he, he won't be in Smash Bros. Because he's not a video game character. But, yeah... I could go over some tri Nintendo trivia here. Basically, Popeye is the character that actually inspired Super Mario Bros. I'm just telling you that fact. So, there. So, Nintendo, and yeah, if Nintendo really wants to put a non video game character in Smash Bros., I think Popeye would probably be one of the first. Because if you don't, yeah, Popeye inspired the Super Mario series. Because Mario was actually created because Nintendo couldn't get the Popeye license. So, yeah, that's some Nintendo, that's some really old oh, Nintendo trivia there. And yeah, Popeye was as exact as the character that inspired Super Mario Bros. to be made. Because the tail couldn't get the license for Super Mario, no for Popeye, so they made their own character. Yeah, Anakin Skywalker won't be in Smash, won't be in Smash, Bars and Boo. Rainbow Dash won't be in Smash, My Little Pony sucks. Pengu, a meme, won't be in Smash. Miku, won't be in Smash. Superman, won't be in Smash. Iron Man, no. Giant Bravo, no. No, no. No, no. Won't be in Smash. 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 Won't, okay, FNAF won't be in Smash. We all know that won't happen. Won't be in Smash. Won't, won't be in Smash. Won't be in Smash. Won't be in... Dizzymon won't be in Smash, bros. Oh, I, 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 I was going to... Professor Ray is a video game character, not a movie character. Won't be in Smash. Ray won't be in Smash. Basically, and yeah, the characters that won't be in Smash, of course, obviously the non-video game characters I skimmed over, won't be in Smash, won't be in Smash, PlayStation character, won't be in Smash, won't be in Smash because Andros is a supporting head, won't, no Dizimon, won't be in Smash, Tarn Stingerton won't be in Smash, Heavy won't be in Smash, I will explain that one, Rainbow Yep won't be in Smash, Yep. Michael Myers won't be in Smash. Pearl won't be in Smash. Venus and Ferb won't be in Smash. This person won't be in Smash. Rezzy, he's a, he's only a me character. That's a joke. He's only a me character in Smash Bros. Max Brad, alright, that's an arms character. Lois won't be in Smash. I was thinking Max Brad was a cartoon character. That's an arms character. <coughs> Smash won't be in Smash. Yoda won't be in Smash. Travis Touchdown is not a Star Wars character, so... And yep, that's basically it. So that is the top ten characters that will be that will be in, should be Smash Bros. by the top ten. This list is completely terrible. Do not ever look, unless you want to go on this list that they will actually vote up characters that should be in Smash Bros. Actually deserve to be in Smash Bros. Then don't go on this list. Okay, it's bullcrap. A bunch of you know non-video game characters, and that's basically it. Goodbye.